So, back in the day when I was looking at the sky, I used to see like a group of stars there and I always wonder what those stars were. So, sometime later, I actually bought a binoculars and I saw those group of stars. They look magnificent. They are so bright, they are so beautiful. I didn't pay attention to what those were. I just kind of once in a while I look at it at this time of the day or at this time of the season and at some point later I bought a telescope and I did look at them they look beautiful I started learning about constellations I started learning about oh my god the, these are Pleiades these are seven sisters also called as seven sisters I was like amazed by the way they look so during this time october november december if you look to the eastern side of the sky you should see like a cluster of stars and if you can barely make out uh, maybe take a binoculars and have a look at it i think your curiosity will increase when you actually start looking at those stars so i'm using you know a small system but it's wide field uh, this is called Red Cat, if you are not familiar. Uh, this is made by William Optics. This is one of their flagship product, the Red Cat. It is FPL 53 glass. So it's very powerful. It's already flat field. So you don't need to put any flattener in the back. Uh, it gives you like edge to edge flat stars. But you do need to get your back focus right the back focus here so it is not really uh, 55 millimeters back focus from the end of the tube here to the sensor of the camera so it is more than that it's like 59 something and depends on the camera sensor size you may need to go maybe a back further than what was given in the spec so anyway i'll uh, try to take a picture of the uh, pleiades and i'll show you guys with this one so inside uh, I have a star Arizona uh, filter slider and an IR UV filter. So I set this up on the CGX mount. Um, I did put a uh, like a lens moving kind of thing. So this will uh, help me actually make the focus uh, right because this will slow down the movement of it. Uh, if I use with my hand, it tends to move much faster, but if I use this, uh, it will actually go like one tenth of the speed. So it's pretty neat that way. Uh, of course, my uh, cable management. So if you are new to this channel, I take pictures of deep space objects. I do some uh, product reviews. I take um, pictures of comets, asteroids. Uh, so if you are interested in watching these videos, please feel free to subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching. started to change.